So, you wanna become a web designer? Okay, don't worry, follow me guys. Well, it's me Silas. Welcome to my channel, SBRC Infos Nepal. So, if you are new to this channel, please go to the description. You will find the link to our playlist. And other video are uploaded in this playlist. Well, guys, in this fourth video of front-end development, I'm gonna design website template in Bootstrap grid pattern. Let's start in our Now we are in our computer screen and this is our computer screen uh, today I am going to make uh, uh, this website template uh, in bootstrap pattern that is uh, divided into uh, uh, two belts part of uh, part of column here you can see uh, this is two part two part it's uh, six six column and here is uh, three uh, and you can search here bootstrap get to bootstrap.com then go to the um, CSS then here you can find uh, here bootstrap grid pattern like here per column uh, 1 to 12 12 column you can manage like this uh, one part eight and next part it four and four 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 like this but you know, total is our two bell columns here you can see here two bell columns and go to google then you can search here bootstrap grid psd and you can click this link From here you can download this then okay this is the my download file I'm going to copy this and paste here in desktop okay I'm going to extract this extract here here is uh, two files but uh, we need a Excel files grid Excel and I'm going to open this Then here you can uh, find these types of interface. Uh, there is the 12 columns. You can count this. And unnecessary information, I'm going to delete this information. This one is delete. And next one is, um, I think, this one. Okay. This one is also delete. And here is the 12 columns. You can count. And we are designed uh, any website template in this term. Okay, I'm going to uh, design this websites. Okay. First, I'm going to making a group, which is the header part. And under this header part, I'm going to making layer in this layer I'm drag this one okay one thirty one twenty nine something okay and color is white here you can see here and then I'm going to okay here is I need a logo you can uh, download logo by inspect element and here you can also drag and drop but uh, when you drag and drop directly drag and drop from website there is look like uh, not good uh, 
and this is the png file so png file we must need to download i'm going to download this one and i'm going to drag and drop from download file where is um okay this one drag and drop here okay there is when you drag uh, from directly from website and, um, if this image is um, png file then it will be black like so you, you must need to download then you can drag and drop okay the next part is this text i'm going to copy this text then choose this tool and here you can paste ctrl v i'm going to color this one is color and okay text color is this and size is this okay and here it's all our bold but i not need to all our bold okay here is uh, some part uh, is uh, next color this color is uh, like mm, this one okay okay this color i think mm, little bit dark okay it's okay then you can manage here size Mm, 34 you can manually control the size mm, move. okay this one is a little bit yeah and now uh, this one is complete and In next group under the header group there is the logo part logo part in under logo part out this text and logo and next group next group is um, which um, top right okay top right group uh, in top right group under the under this group uh, I'm going to keep this design uh, text tool then I'm going to here drag i needed space then you can paste here and i'm going to arrange this you can see here i'm going to arrange this uh, font si font type lato mm, yeah uh, i'm going to arrange the space by move tool you can move uh, as for your, your required all are bold then you can click this button then all will be yeah. no need you must write in bold letter And I need this icons. I'm going to download this icon by fontawesome.com. I have already told you to how to download this fontawesome uh, in our previous videos. Control F, and I'm going to this one and color will be this one. Control V and select this one and change the font fontawesome.com font awesome our font name is then move as for your required locations and next one other color will be this one black but our icons colors color will 
orange control f and here i'm going to search in another icons another icon is plain this one i'm going to copy this and again paste here control v and change the font or some font married up pro to font awesome.com font awesome then you can change here color of these icons this one is good okay uh, next I need to this uh, I'm going to okay this one uh, this one icon you can fill H for a required icon and this one uh, I'm going to move here and here okay this one is like good and I need these types of arrow I mean then next new layer then in this layer I can I'm going to make this straw then go to edit and straw here you can choose the color then okay okay this one is extra and I'm going to uh, by rectangular tool I'm going to cut here then uh, you can um, feather type in feather you can um, color shape okay then you can copy this one and then here I'm going to arrange this and if you want to duplicate like this and you can uh, by control J and I'm going to cut uh, unnecessary line by here I'm going to cut then press the control J you can duplicate at same line this one is my uh, layer to copy and you can move by move tool okay guys this one is complete and i'm going to copy this text this text copy and i need this color by idopper you can copy and here you paste Okay, guys. Then select the area. This one is our search engine. Uh, I need this. Okay. Mm, okay. This one is complete. And next one is text text color will this and text name is sorts okay so it's in, it will be in between and i need a sorts icon then by uh, you can find here and copy and paste here and this font uh, you can change here font awesome then it look like sorts icons 
and you can arrange here okay if you hide this uh, okay this next group next group name is source and this layer are under the source group in this way you can arrange the group If you arrange uh, by group, then you must need to do work. Then I need this one. Here I am going to paste and color with this. And you can increase the size of this uh, area as for your required. and font you can change the font like italian any and this one is okay then i need uh, this totally is this okay then i need a, na a navigation bar and i'm making a nav group under the nav group i i have one layer in this layer i'm going to making a navigate for navigation navigation is um, almost height is uh, 50 Mm, 49 I'm going to 50 49 you can set here I'm going to set this and uh, here I'm going to copy this text S select and copy and next layer I'm go going to paste the text I'm going to arrange this and color. Mm, this is unnecessary. I'm going to remove this one and back. This one is also back, and I'm going to set the space home. from here and paste this to arrange the equal size about us okay then here paste block then contact okay almost this one is also complete mm, this yeah it's also look like a beautiful and you can set the uh, shadow like this you can increase or increase the size shadow like this shadow color will like this you can see the in text under the text it's like shadow and you can set the angles of shadow and here i'm going to I need these pictures then you can copy these pictures first of all you need to download I'm going to download these pictures otherwise you can drag and drop also uh, and arrange these pictures 
yeah this picture is also like looking good and i'm going to copy this text and this text you can make um, like blur of a whole pictures like this when you said like this and uh, uh, your text will be looking so clearly like a blur and copy this and under the center then size will i'm going to write um, 30 okay then okay i'm going to make a bold this text and double click this layer and you can make the shadow Yeah, it look like a beautiful. Then I need these icons. Then you can arrange this icon. I'm going to making these icons. Uh, here you can choose these icons. Then you can set width and height 50-50. As per required, you can set any height and width then you can reduce the optic if you don't reduce the optic it will be too dark and i need these icons of arrow then by text you can paste here and change the font and font or some this one is and you can set here font size then arrange it and another part I need this then control J to copy make a duplicate then this one is in this side then also I need icon but this icon is opposite side I need to another icons then I'm going to here and copy these icons. Then Control V here, and this one is copy. And I'm going to move here as for my required locations. this one is good I have completed this side in to here and others are for you to homework you must need to complete this it will be practice for you I'm going to save this one save for web I have already um, said to you you how to save this in previous video yeah I'm going to show you this one double click this it's like really it's like a website this one is template okay guys Thank you for watching the video guys if you are new to this channel please do not forget to subscribe if you are already part of the channel do not forget to practice every day and do not forget to share with your friend because sharing is caring if you enjoy this one 
I would like to say make sure do subscribe our channel and hit that like button and our motivation is passion and conviction without action is only theoretical conception so please leave the comment below hashtag challenge accepted and do practice everything